Many people that enter here yesterday, when they come, they say, Ah, prophet, what, how did you do this? Is it the magic or what? I said, The time of God has come. Remember on our anniversary, I told you the church will soon start their project. Is it not, is it not what I said? Yes, sir. Eh? Did I say it or not? You say so. When you understand the glory, he said, I will show mercy upon whom I will show mercy. He said, I will be gracious to whom I will be gracious. Which means, grace means favor. And favor means success. The Israelites we talk about today are people that God has promised a land flowing with milk and honey. When it comes to technology, they are among the top class in technology. You come for anything, industrialism and all, they are number one. Yet, because of hunger, their father went to the land of Egypt to just buy food so that hunger will not kill them. So that hunger will not kill them. By the cup of wheat, it was where he lost all the children. Everybody now were captured under captivity. Some of us in this country are under captivity as a result of poverty, as a result of frustration, as a result of one thing or the other. But God in heaven delivered that is time for everything. That is time for everything. That is time for everything. And today is the time. Amen. I said today is the time. Amen. I prophesy in your spirit. I receive Let it. God ginger your spirit. Amen. Let God steer your spirit. Amen. Let God wake your spirit. Amen. To begin to receive what belongs to you. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Some of you are not supposed to be in, 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 in a lion's den because you're married. Some of you are not supposed to be in the dungeon of poverty because you come from a particular section. I want to let you know that there's nowhere or nothing in this world that God is not aware of. There's time for everything. Some of you also are not supposed to be nursing sickness in your body. Every day, headache, leg pain, nose pain, eye pain, this one, that one. You are struggling with from here to here, this one to hospital. To, you are not supposed. Something went wrong somewhere. That is why I'm talking about the glory. When Moses encountered the glory right there on the mountain, Moses saw the burning bush. The bush was burning but was not consumed. And Moses came close and said, no, don't come here. Remove your shoe. Because where you are standing is the holy ground. As you are right here on the holy ground, I want to show you another thing you have not seen before. I have seen the affliction of my people that are in Egypt and the suffering of my people and the punishment that is being melted against my people. And I have come to liberate them. That was how Moses encountered the presence of God and the glory of God that never departed where he is. My prayer for you today, it doesn't matter the level you are, it doesn't matter where you're coming from, it doesn't matter how many years you have fight for, it doesn't matter what and what you have been doing before or how you are coming from, all that matters is that the time of the Lord has come. Amen. Because his glory that filled the whole universe is going to visit you. Amen. The glory is going to take over you. Amen. Some of you may not know the glory I'm talking about. The same glory was the glory that was with them as a pillar of fire by the night. And in the day was with them as a pillar of cloud. That was the glory that moved ahead of them. When people that enter here yesterday, when they come, they say, Ah, prophet, what, how did you do this? Is it magic or what? I said the time of God has come. Amen. <laughs> Remember on our anniversary, I told you the church will soon start their project. Is it not, it's not what I said? Yes, sir. Eh? Did I say it or not? You say so. I don't make my budget on the money I have in my pocket. I make my budget on heavenly provision. When you understand the glory, he said... I will show mercy upon whom I will show mercy. He said, I will be gracious to whom I will be gracious. Which means, grace means favor. 
And favor means success. And success means abundance. Abundance means having everything that you need in your life. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Everything that you need, the grace is available for you today. Amen. Receive grace. Receive grace. Amen. Receive the grace. Amen. Receive the grace. Amen. Receive the grace. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. All that is said to you, have no other God beside me. Yes, sir. Eh? Yes, sir. Have no what? Other God. Never, never you. you think of it. Many of us are having been guilty. We are seeking for other gods where we already have a God that filled the whole universe. Our God filled the whole universe. And that's why I said in a song. Did you really where you are? Oh, did you really where you are? Oh, did you really where you are? Did you really where you are? Oh, did you really where you are? 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 Ebu peki churi kwe, ebu peki ewe kato, ebu peki tingosi, ebu bechu kwa churuwa, ebu bechu kwa churi kwe, ebu bechu kwa churuwa, ebu bechu kwa tingosi. Your glory fill the world. Your glory fill heaven. Your glory fill all the world. Your glory is uncomparable. Your glory fill the world. Your glory fill heaven. Your glory fill the world. Your glory is uncomparable. Hey! Ebu beli we o. Ebu Everybody, <laughs> Is more than whatever you are thinking about. The glory of God is more than anything you ever imagine in your heart. I pray for the activation of the glory in your life. Amen. Jesus' name, we worship. Amen. Lift up your hands. Father, in the name of Jesus. Amen. That was said, by power shall no man prevail. It is not by power, it is never by might. But by the Spirit of God, you did not create yourself. When you were given to your mother, right in your mother's womb, you were in the one that take decision to come into the world. God took the decision for you. Yes, sir. When they give back to you, you are not in the decision making or whatever. God did all of that for you. So without your mother, without anybody, without anything, the same God is capable of fulfilling his glory in your life. Amen. Whatever you came to the world that has been tampered, I don't care to know who tampered it. 
All I know is that God used today's glorious service to restore you in the name of Jesus. Amen. Restore your family in the name of Jesus. Amen. Restore your generation in the name of Jesus. Amen. Restore your health in the name of Jesus. Amen. Restore your star in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Elai la masabatani obo Elai la masabatani obo Elai la masabatani Lift up your hands As I'm singing that song In the realm of the spirit In the realm of the physical Whatever is not okay The Lord is going to settle it now Amen Elai la masabatani obo Elai la masabatani obo Lift up your hands. Lift up your hands and pray this word. Ribra katoko shita katese. Father, your people have appeared before you. We assemble ourselves in your presence, Jehovah, that your glory may take over. That which the enemy have deprived us, no more, no more. Say amen, no more. I say no more. Amen. They can never deprive you again. Amen. amen. That which they have stopped you. I said they can never stop you again. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you, Jehovah. Thank you, Lord. Because it is done. Amen. Jesus' name we pray. Amen. amen. Show divider. Jehovah Rapha, my creator. 